we have taken over Stout Hall here, rescuing this building that's been abandoned for more than 10 years now to renovate it and turn it into an adventure centre and a rather unique wedding venue in the heart of Gower. Uh, we've been doing some work with Swansea Uni uh, through the WISE network. As part of that, we were kind of led towards uh, the SD Charter. It kind of tied in with two of our goals, so, you know, in terms of cooperating with different organisations. And as well, it gives a, a real public way to display our commitment. For us, sustainability is about context, really, about understanding the economical context, the environmental context and the social context of, of our enterprise and our operation. So from the beginning, it's been about looking at how we can, yes, be more energy efficient, but I think that's a minimum, really, with sustainability. We want to be a benefit to the local community. We want to be involved in, in the local and wider community. We want to be an important part of Wales. We want to be able to demonstrate to people how a sustainable approach can be replicated and it makes good business sense to be sustainable from a, you know, a financial point of view, a marketing perspective and going into the future. One of the reasons this building has been in the situation it's been in is that no one has had the kind of the right creative approach towards restoring it in a way that benefits a whole variety of people who've been involved. And so because we've adopted uh, a sustainable approach from the, from the very beginning, that has meant that we've, we've actually had the chance to do this. Well, at this stage of the project, um, at the early stages and the startup stage, it's been about cooperation and communication. So actively going out of our way to find partnerships with um, local educational organisations, the community, local businesses and suppliers. It's also been about communication and from the beginning of this project we've communicated with the community about our intentions and also our aspirations for the project and very much sought feedback from people on how we can improve on those aspirations. Gower is kind of well known for the difficulties with planning and the planning process is often seen as quite a combative process but because of the approach we've taken we didn't have a single objection we had letters of support coming to the planners which as the planning officer described was nothing short of miraculous. We found a huge amount of support, support for us, support for the possibility of, of jobs and wealth within the community but also for this building, this building that's sat empty for 10 years with no interest. You know slightly further down the line we want to take this business model and then try and replicate it in you know with other at-risk buildings in rural Wales.